You know, I heard this really interesting thing the other... Uh... Hello. This week I will be diving into the mysterious parts of the body. Actually, it's one of the more simpler parts and it should just be called one because it will be made out of three pieces of alder glued together to a solid block. And that's basically all it's going to be made of. Touch me! Touch me! Now I want to feed! Oh, oh, okay. Maybe for the outro then? No, I'm just kidding. Oh, there's a really light type of wood. This is now a pretty standard Jazzmaster body. Two pickup cavities, another two for the electronics, and don't worry, I will explain more about them in future videos. Custom place hole for the jack, holes for bridge and tailpiece, neck pocket, with a file out track from the neck picket so that you can adjust the truss rod while the neck is still on there. Of course, you have to remove the neck pickup and all that jibber jabber. Well, let's not go into details here. Belly and armrest cut, edges slightly rounded off, and finally a slight thinner overall thickness. This because I simply like my bodies to be a little bit thinner. Now about the countersink bridge holes. I'm going for a tunematic and a tape piece on this. Spoilers! And for it to be low enough for a straight non-angled neck, I had to countersink that area. Yes, I could have made a neck pocket less deeper, but I wondered where it is right now, and really, no one's gonna see this while the bridge is on there. The lighter spots that you see a little bit all over is called fake wood, which is a type of filler that is especially made for a screw-up like myself when I do a little doo-doo. Which is basically all the time. It looks a little bit messy right now, but all that's gonna go away once it's finished in a nice... I'm Tommy to Shiron, and thanks for watching. Oh, okay, not this time either, but maybe in the next video, huh?